Hello YouTube and welcome back to Old Flats. Now, where you left us last, we were a little despondent, I must admit. I'm going to apologise for my... Well, it was somewhat disheartened after getting killed. I was, I was a bit... I was trying not to rage too hard. But uh, we've made it down to the eastern towns. And what I would like to do is enter this hospital and get some supplies before we go down again. Where did that zombie aggro from? So I'm hopefully going to get some supplies. So There's also a supermarket a bit further down. So we're going to head down the length of... I think this is Jessenice? Jessenice? Something like that. And uh, we're going to pick up the supplies which are going to be quite necessary, especially the, uh, the morphine. And then... What have we got here? Industrial? Industrial. And then we're going to head down towards the desert, which I'm... Th this server is, n is, a, is a fairly experienced server. There's, there's plenty of people on here that know exactly what they're doing. So whether or not there'll be people down there, I don't know. There is a lot of military loot down there. And also there seem to be a lot of helicopter crashes and general loot sites as well. So it, it'll be good for us to get down there, see what we can find... And then gear up again to go and find this guy who's got our DMR. We're not going to be able to find him, I don't suppose. But we will uh, we'll certainly kill any people with a DMR that we see. And we'll claim them as scalps. I think that works nicely. So what I need to do now is try and get in here without causing too much disturbance. Although that's not going to be easy. I need a tin can. If you didn't know, that is the purpose of tin cans, essentially. Great jerry cans. They are there to... For some reason the glass is bugging out on that, so I've just alerted a load of zombies for no particular reason. Wonderful. Okay, so uh, I'll see you in a bit after I've managed to figure out how I'm going to get into this goddamn hospital. Right, guys, so by, uh, by hook or by crook, I've actually got in. If you didn't know, these boxes inside the hospitals, of which there are a considerable amount in here, they hold the main medical loots. So in here, we've got 10 bandages, 5 blood bags, 5 epipens, 5 morphine auto injectors, 5 painkillers. And, and they, that was, that's su completely sufficient. One of those boxes is enough for a, several people. But there's five of the boxes in here. So, I mean, if you brought a car down here, you could load up entirely on medical loot. And you'd be set for weeks. Which is obviously, wow, that's a lot of zombies. Run away! This is obviously of a massive benefit. Should you be able to get down here. However, that is pretty much, short of finding a hatchet mission accomplished as far as I'm concerned because we just need drink and food if there is any we're pretty good for ammo this CZ 55 I think we've got uh, yeah we've got we've got 75 rounds for it so that's fine we're good on good on ammo PDW takes any nine millimeter rounds which are fairly easy to find what's in and we if we can find a hatchet, we won't even need drink because we've got some here. Another water bottle. This is empty, unfortunately, but never mind. How did you find me? Christ, he took a bait in. And now I'm bleeding. Great. Right, anyway, I shall move down to the uh, shopping centre and I shall see you in a bit. Okay, guys, so we've moved further along the town now and we've moved into the store. Look what we've got here. Boom! Map time! And I also found a hatchet as well, so everything is going really nicely at the moment. So we are preparing for our trip down into the desert. Deserts are, of course, very nasty places to go. So we're going to have to be especially careful down there. But as long as we're fully prepared, we've got all our meds now. We've got weaponry, we've got bandages, we've got food don't need that. We could do with a bigger backpack if I'm honest. I'd like to be able to take a second gun because I've already had to leave behind a uh, 
an AKM, which I wasn't particularly impressed about, but I didn't want to get rid of the scope rifle because I just prefer to have the range option. The good news, though, is that there are two supermarkets here, right next to each other. So we're going to be... What's that? I can hear a zombie. So we are going to be pretty well stocked out. And that map is a real, real godsend. Really happy with that. So much food in here. There's not really anything else I need before we head down. That's going to be the next point you see me, unless I, there is some uh, traffic of some description. So I think we're going to call that it. I think we're ready. I think we're going to be good to go once we get down there. Could do with some decent clothing, but anyway. I'll see you in the desert going to be hot. Right guys, so, turns out I was by an airfield. I've been using Daisy DB. Some people call it easy mode. I call it, well, I haven't got a bloody clue where I am mode, so I'm going to look at a map. Uh, and, well, there's a tent right in the middle of it for a start. There's also some military loot up there. So, we are going to go up here and hopefully see if we can get some loot. Now, the only problem is is that I do know that there are some people here, or supposedly here, that have found a helicopter. Now, as long as they're friendly, that's cool, because I could do with a helicopter lift. That would certainly make the journey a lot swifter. There's a Hilux there. That would make life a lot easier. A lot, a lot easier. Although, by the looks of it from here... What's that new with my guy? Oh, now we're looking on damage. Still trying to catch his breath. That doesn't look too bad, actually. So, I think we're going to take this truck. We certainly need it. I don't really want to have to run all the way down there. It'll take a bloody age. But... I just wonder if that was the truck. That is the truck that chased us in the car chase. I don't know if you guys remember back to that video, but that car was chasing us. Oh, that was definitely it. I'll have to have a look back and check. There doesn't seem to be anyone here. So I think we're just going to help ourselves to this. Could certainly do with it. Uh, right, zombies have spawned. They're me, so I'm not too fussed about that. How is this thing doing? My, it's got a gun on top of it. That's awesome. Right, let's get in the driver's seat. How are we doing? Oh my god, it's full. We're off. Splendid. That means I can have a gunner. Anyone want to be a gunner? You want to be a gunner? Contact me on Twitter or on comment in the channel. Come and be my gunner. That'd be freaking awesome. I love it. Okay, right. To the desert. Right, guys, as you've seen, we've ended up in Zelezniki. I think that's how you pronounce it. Uh, so we're leaving the truck, and it's all on foot from here on in. Terrain is obviously vastly different up here. I could have taken the truck in, but to be honest, I want to leave it there. Hopefully it will still be there, because I don't know what to expect down here. I'm, I'm half expecting it to be like Cherno, which, uh, what? Wow. Let's go and look over there. Well, someone had a pretty bad day. That's not a loot plane. Someone's actually crashed that. <laughs> Mental. So we found the airfield. This is technically, I believe, Smuggler's Den. What a view it is. It's just wreckage and old buildings and relics of the past. It looks like... Well, it doesn't look very, very uh, hospitable, does it? We are going to have to make our way down here, but I already know that someone's here. 
which is why I don't really like the side chat. It's like meta gaming, and uh, it takes a bit out of it. But I do know there are people here, and uh, there's Gaz. But we're going to leave that for the time being because we've we've only come here to pick up a DMR, and if it's not here. So we're going to have to go and find it somewhere else. Just to give you a bit of an idea of the geography of the area that we're visiting at the moment. That over there is New Schooner. And, well, New seems a bit rich. Looks like a bit of a dump, to be honest. Uh, we're not going there. We're going to an army base, which has two high-value loot barracks in it. Um, now, obviously, the chances of finding sniper rifles or high-velocity rifles are very, very slim, especially after a new patch, because I believe they've altered the loot table now. But what we are hoping for is to go down there. I mean, it's pretty dangerous, to be perfectly honest. Oh, burn out car. I haven't seen one of them for a while. This is, this is as you can tell, this is the rough end of Panthera. You've got the beautiful bit where we were, and now we've got the bad old end. Well, hopefully we're going to find the loot, so I think it's going to be a bit like running a gauntlet, but... Well, it's the risk we have to take. We want to get our DMR back, we then want to go hunting people. And I want a helicopter, or at least they're going a helicopter ride, but also with the planes on here, I would love a, a plane ride. I don't know where we go in the plane particularly, but it would be great to go in it. Anyway, so let's head down to the army base, see if we can't find something. Okay, guys, so we got down to the military base, and uh, turns out there was quite a lot of zombies here. You'll see that the condition of me at the moment is very, very bad. I've killed, well, however many zombies this was. I just got completely swarmed by them. I didn't know what to do about it. Uh, so, well, in the end, we just had to uh, it was massacre, basically. I, I'm in such desperate need of a blood bag now though it's it's actually not even true and there is gear in it apparently Winchester M249 belt nothing of any real interest okay I think I must have killed every single zombie here because there, there is about 20 in there and I completely used all my sod in CZZ or whatever it is, CZ 550 rounds. It's all gone. Oh, fuck off. Excuse my language, guys, but I've just had enough of zombies now. He must have been like the last one in there. M4, don't want that. I think this place has more than likely already been looted, unfortunately. But we had to give it a bit of a go. But now. The trouble is, I'm in a world of trouble with my blood levels. So, uh, I could really do with either some of the vaults guys getting involved and making their way over to Panthera Island, or hopefully someone will actually be kind enough to give me blood. It's, uh, it's a long shot. We're going to have to rely on the guys on this server to actually be kind. I've been old flads. Thank you very much. And goodbye.